welcome back to me playing XCOM. Long War mod. In enemy within. I screwed it up. But it hasn't been a couple of days that I've played since... Well, goddamn hell happened and the, the last DLC of Dark Souls 2 came out and I was like, Oh my god, I wanna play. So I played that a lot. But now I'm back for some more XCOM action. That's right. And we're gonna go into a one or small structure in a remote location settlement kind of mission. I'm scared terrified. Uh, so I decided to take this team, and you might be asking, why does Ven have not her Shatter Ray? Because the Shatter Ray is not a shotgun. It's actually an SMG, as you can see in Clear Doubt 10. And it's a very bad weapon, actually. Well, it's an upgrade to the normal SMG, mind you, but... So where is my decision? Where, where did I decide? How did I decide to take what I took? Well, Ven has still the strongest weapon. It outclasses all of the laser weapons we've created thus far. Brent has the laser carabine and Dalek has the laser rifle simply because it has better range, however it has the same damage, better critical chance, not better range, better critical chance, however same damage, same critical damage and uh, uh, well less ammo capacity but it's an overall better weapon than the saw. Uh, Tisk has a very good weapon and uh, he, he's able to snipe everything with it, so I don't think he needs anything laser-wise. So this freed, freed morons here, I'm kidding. Uh, her, the moron, and these two guys, the A-team guys, are gonna have the laser rifles. The, the laser waifus. Okay, let us launch mission! Woo. Uh, what do I expect from this mission? Floaters, sectoids, possibly seekers, uh, small Tiny bot thingies. Uh, I don't remember. But about that. The area yeah, of engagement this, one. this mission will be in India. We're still seeing dozens of reported abduction attempts coming in from cities around the world. You'll be deploying at the site of the latest report. All right. Now, we have six different nationalities in this team, so everyone has a very big boost to to will. Six points, in fact, thanks to Van being the leader of the team. This mission, oh, this map is not my favorite. Requesting authorization to deploy. Solid copy, Big Sky. Strike one is clear to engage. But it's not a big deal overall, I I'm think. I'm gonna do a bit of cross movement because I think this corner over here is the safest spot we have on the mission. So we'll try to move them accordingly. Then could move over here. Let's see if she sees anything. She saw some mail over there, but nothing recoverable quite yet. If Brent goes here, will he spot anyone? No. Okay. Tease, can you go down there? No, you can't go down there. However, you could go down here. So for now, we're gonna keep the squad very, very tightly packed up, because if someone appears, we want a bunch of overwatches ready to go. Okay, Isidoro Vega, you suck. Um, just steady weapons. Everyone else can overwatch. See what happens. Uh, I think we should secure the lower sector of the map and then move slightly towards the upper sector. Very likely all the aliens are around here. Uh, whereas I doubt there's gonna be many down here in this section. So I want to enlarge and broaden up the uh, area of operation in such a way so that we know that we're relatively safe where we're headed and so that we can then later on uh, uh, have uh, a nice secure position to kill aliens. So right now I'm trying to spot any alien uh, as slowly as possible without triggering uh, any uh, dashes or anything and if they flank us from uh, our current position then we can always dash but for the time being seems like it's fine. Uh, how about you go into the... Ah, that is quite far away might be risky. If there's floaters and they go into overwatch mode, whatever. Never had any doubt about cleared out, so whatever. Everyone overwatch. Well, Isidoro Vega could could have gone into... Okay. Yeah, no kidding. Oh. Oh, wait for it. Wait for it. They didn't go. We didn't look at them. We didn't look at them go. Um, okay, Brent. You lacked as a scout of sorts. 
Not the favorite spot to be in, for sure, but for the time being it will be fine. So right now I'm shifting a bit my troops in such a way that they stay safe. I'm ready to assume you're safe there. You are. Where the hell are the aliens? This is like a heavy activity mission and there is absolutely nothing yet. If it's gonna be one of those missions where literally 20... Oh shit. Not there. Please not there. Everywhere but there. Don't flank me. Don't flank me, aliens. Please. Please. I've broken up my position in such a... Such a nice way. Nothing! Are you friggin' kidding me? Okay. Where is everyone? That's a good question, actually. Wh where is everyone, guys? <laughs> where the hell is everyone? Got it covered. Alright. I don't know why that is a negative spot to be. Maybe because it's half cover? Makes sense, I guess. Maybe it's just his willpower. Good to go. Currently playing tricks on him. But I think we have a good position right now. Sure, aliens could be around here, but... Okay. Oh, there they are! Some floaters. Nothing we cannot handle. Oh, fuck. Okay, that's scary. That is terrifying, actually. I heard some peter light peter-pattering noises of sectoids. Okay, Brent, how far away can you go? Um, the problem is floaters are definitely down there, so if we move someone, we might spot them if we move them over here. Let's first analyze and see what is over there. Then, you see nothing. She could in theory go on the roof, but that would be an, um, a risk I am unwilling to take. Uh, I'm gonna position my troops in such a way so that we can have three troops shooting at them next turn, wherever they are. So we know that essentially we're gonna be able to take at least one of them down. That's my hope, at least. Okay, Dalek, is there any full cover you can take? Not really. So just stay there for the time being. Cleared out. Undoubtedly, I am unsure about you. Ah, uh, yeah, sure, Overwatch. Pretty much everyone should go into Overwatch, yeah. Dalek, where can I move you so that you're real? You know what? Move here for the time being. We're gonna move you into some full cover next turn. I think that's gonna work. Okay, now that is a bit more pesky. Okay. There we go. Triggers a reaction shot from Tiss, who is going to... Miss. You know they should actually... Tone down the dr drama of the reaction shots, like, I got this! <gasps> Another reaction shot from Pride Fruit Class Vega. Oh, damn, Dalek! Nice kill. Okay. Now I'm pretty safe to assume we can uh, surround the aliens over here. However, let us send first Brent. My thought is, if there's someone over here in this corridor that we don't like... Yeah, it's three sectoids. Going the wrong way! Okay, so what is your chance to kill? Well, pretty much very high for that guy, so... Go for it, Brent. Alright, taking care of one. Then... You have a very good shot at this guy. No shot at all at the other guy, though. So do you, really. You have a shot at that guy, anyway. 41. Okay. Problem is, those sectoids are right now flanking us, but it's... Not tragic bad. As in, uh, we have all the troops ready to shoot. Uh, Vega, 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 Vega. What are you gonna do with me, Vega? Flank them with Vega. That looks like a pretty damn sure chance to kill. Yeah. Okay, I made a good choice then. Now Van can finish off the last remaining one by flanking him over here. 
Easy kills. Ease money. All safe. Okay, so my theory, my, my tactic here worked well. Now let's see. Dalek has no shot at that guy, so how about we move him over here? It's not gonna trigger anyone. He has a 41 times 2. What do you have, this? 41 times 1. How about we try... Uh, he has a uh, holo targeting. So this is gonna improve Dalek's shot. Uh, she doesn't have any shots, so that's unfortunate, but not the end of the world. Let's take the shot. It's a miss. We cannot do much about it. Uh, it's fine, though. You go into Overwatch. Let's see what happens this turn. Uh, both Dalek and Tis are in full cover. Oh, that's two health for Mind Melt, so they improve that. That, guy, that could prove pesky, so we need to be careful about those guys. Okay, there is a reaction from uh, Cleared Out, who is going, Oh my god, that, that shot off. So I need to be careful in case they go uh, Overwatch now. Uh, where is what is that guy doing? Can you take a sh You can take a shot. You gonna... Oh my god! Please! Ah, emergency evac. Please, Cleared Out. You're fine! You're fine! Everything is fine, sweet tart! Okay, so they have an overwatch over there, which I don't like too much. We'll have to trigger it somehow. And on top of all, Dalek and uh, Tiss aren't in the best positions available for sure. I could move Dalek. I feel like this is gonna trigger the overwatch, so I don't wanna do it. I have the flashbang here that could flashbang that guy, however, I cannot suppress him. Not enough ammo, apparently it takes two ammo, so that's unfortunate, but not, not the end of the world. Okay, let's see first on this side. Um, Vega, you would be a hero if you triggered that overwatch and didn't get shot at it. Please don't, 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 don't die. Good, alright. I could have used this, but this was further away, so I don't know if it would have worked. Okay, Van, what you got for me? Possible flank in a dangerous position, but definitely existing. But this one is much safer, I think, but it's not gonna be a flank, so let's run and gun. Go there, see what happens. It's not gonna be a flank, but... Oh, it has two shots, actually. Uh, just take this one. Maybe it's gonna be a kill, maybe it's not. It's a miss. Not the end of the world. We got this shit. We got this. Okay, Mr. Vega. Be the Grenadier cleared out is never gonna be. Can I see somehow if I'm hitting all three of those? There we go. So this is actually gonna make sure that Ven is relatively safe, because they're gonna be all disoriented. Okay, Brent. How far can you move? And who can you sh shoot? That guy. I presume you're pretty safe up here, so just take the shot. God knows it might hit. It's a nice hit. Decent enough. Okay, now, this guy's... Uh, let's see that we decide. Let's see to it that we decide what to do. That guy is quite pesky. Dalek has a flashbang. So if we cannot kill him, we can flashbang him. So how about we move Tiss over here? Oh boy! There's another one over there. It's a sectoid, of course. Um, yeah, probably gonna flashbang them too. There's just way too many guys right here. Okay, Dalek. Support team. Does the effect of flashbang stuck? Because that guy's gonna be flashbanged twice now. I don't know if it does. I doubt it. Have a flashbang! There you go. Okay, now these can shoot. Not the greatest shots, but it's existing. How about we steady weapons with him? There is the last sectoid who is not uh, disoriented. He's going to mind melt from a dangerous position if cleared out can flank that guy. That would be amazing. But cleared out is a grenadier. Uh oh. I don't like that. 
that's the move that got, uh, uh, what's her name? The Komori Desu killed. Oh no. Okay, suppression is fine. I, I accept suppression, just not a direct hit. What's gonna happen? Oh my god, all, all the suppressions right now. However, we can still grenade them. Okay, that's good. Oh, there's a lot of them. Okay. You're fucking kidding me! I'm not- no, no, I'm cleared out. Obviously, it's clear enough that I'm not sending her to any other mission. First and foremost, this asshole has to die. I will not risk my team for him. Get out of here. Get out! Good. Good job, Brent. Okay, now. Then you do not have grenades, right? No. Do you? You do. We might need a grenade. I think any sort of damage is going to disrupt their uh, suppression. The question is... I think I directly uh, attack that guy. Hopefully even kill him. It might kill him. If it kills him, that's beautiful. It doesn't, however this should... Yeah, this stops the suppression. Okay, then. Um, you can flank royally here. Oh yeah, all the flanks, look at that. That is... Looks like a 100% chance to kill. To me. Let's go for it then. Good enough. Alright. He's not suppressed, guys, so as long as you can hit him... Then Dalek is gonna have a shot. Nice! Alright. Now Dalek. Nice. Alright, that's that went well. Now we need to be careful. They're very low on health, they're getting flanked, so they're gonna back off in all likelihood. This guy is gonna mind melt. I don't know if that is a great choice there, buddy. Let's see what happens. Yeah, he's backing off. Totally backing off. What is this guy gonna do? Take a shot? Big mistake, buddy. Okay, let's weaken him by killing that sectoid first and foremost. Can we get a shot at him? Cleared out! My god, you're back! Sometimes miracles can happen. Uh, you do have a shot, however, ah, you have no pistols, right, because you're a big guy. I can move this forward, I think it's reasonably safe to do so. He's gonna see that guy in the back. Uh, let's see if we can see him. Nice, okay. That's gonna weaken this guy and this guy's out. Uh, not from- oh, actually, it just kills him outright. I don't know why, but it did. I will not complain about it. You just reload. Um, cleared up, you're gonna move forward. If you have a shot, you might as well take it. If you don't, it's fine. Nah, just reload for the time being, actually. Okay. Vega. You're gonna move over here and you're gonna go into Overwatch. Um... I'm gonna go over here and move into overwatch position. Brent, you're gonna start moving and uh, reloading. I don't know if there is any more aliens, there might be. We killed a bunch of them, mind you. We killed a lot of aliens thus far. But this might be also the last one. Or might not be, as the case might be. Um... So how do we secure the perimeter, making sure that... That's a peaceful shot. What about the marksman rifle shot? Much better. Take it. Beautiful. It's not it yet. Yep, pretty much expected it, actually. Uh, it's a, I mean, it's pretty heavy resistance, so... We need to take it easy now. Uh, it's possible that they're over here. That's the only corner of the map we haven't explored, and it's all very likely that there's another group of floaters or what have you over there. Okay, Vega. 
can go over there and uh, reload. Then we'll also have to reload, but let's move her over the side of the train. Okay, reload. Brent. Brent. Where are you going? Went. So far, very good, actually. No one got hit. She panicked two turns because she's a wuss. Clearly, we're not gonna send her in any other mission. <laughs> well, I heard some meld deactivating. Okay, cleared out. You're completely useless to me. Just explore for me. If you die, that's of no consequence whatsoever. Not to the team, not to the XCOM project. You're useless. Useless! And actually, I would be kind of sad because she's a specially named character. So, B team character. Maybe even C team, actually. Yeah, I think she's a C team. Like, the improvised names are C team. The ones that uh, were decided all together are B team. Does that make any sense? Probably doesn't. Very safe there. Dalek, can you move? How far can you move? Tis can move over here. It's certainly not a... Okay, he has to reload too, so let's reload him. Okay, Yuri Vega. It's not Yuri Vega, it's Isidoro Vega, but whatever. Okay! That is not good for business. Oh boy. Um... You have some shots. Then do you have shots? You don't. Cleared out? You do. 42. I'll just take it. I'll just take it. Whoa! Nice! Okay, you get 5 bonus points for that, um, lady. Can you finish it off? No, you can't. It would be too easy, wow, would it? Wouldn't it? Okay. Dalek like going to the train, maybe you can even have a shot. You do have shots available. Kinda wanna finish this guy off, but... Yeah. Alright. Uh, Van could, in theory, kill someone this time. Let's see first if Brent has any shots from over here. He does. Pretty good damn chance to hit, too. And it's a hit! Okay, these guys are be being melted away one after the other. Now, she could go into run and gun. Not a big run and gun here, mind you, but... Might finish this guy off. I doubt it. I doubt... Okay, never mind. Never doubt in the van. When you're sure about it... Okay, this guy is losing a turn. Oh, you're going into the wrong position, buddy. You ain't flanking my team anymore. Yeah, they're trying to flank us, no kidding. Okay, suppression is acceptable. How do we take care of this guy now? Um, we can flank him from both sides. Cleared out and... Let's see if cleared out is enough. That would be amazing if it's enough. It is. Alright. Alright. That's important because now we can attack this guy, which should be the last one of the group. Ah, we cannot see him from there? That's bullshit. Okay, Dalek, where are you at? Bro. You're here. I could just suppress him, to be completely honest. I think that's the best way to go. He's gonna lose now with the suppression himself? Yes, he is. No, he's not. Uh, never mind. Uh, I'm an idiot. I guess I'm an idiot! Mm. Move there, friend. Take a shot at him. Oh my god. That's bad, that's bad for business right now, guys. I don't like you not being cover, but... Okay, Tiz just finishes it off, I guess. Never mind. Was setting things up for Ven, but... 14 kills, no hurt. I say that is pretty goddamn good. I say pretty goddamn good. Alright, so, this is gonna reduce panic in India minimally. Uh, I doubt it's gonna go below four squares or what, what have you, but... Oh, Tis. Tis Zuzarvis. Tisai Zuzarvis. 
Yeah, that sounds pretty dramatic, doesn't it? I like it. <laughs> I like it. <laughs> Bow scanner. Scanning device that when thrown creates a new source of vision for two turns can only be used twice time tw tw twice per battle. So you get a bonus, or rather, you get two bonus battle scanners, meaning that one of his slots opens up for better items. Fire a shot that causes enemies to run out of cover. The shot is easy to hit, but does reduce damage. Lone Wolf, 10 a.m. and critical chance. Nah, this is not that good. I want to keep him in the group, actually. Now, battles can... I mean, Flush is very good. I don't mind me saying otherwise. However... Battle scanner is useful. I didn't have positive experiences in Long War, so I'm not sure, but I'm pretty goddamn sure that battle scanner is goddamn good. Do I take battle scanner? I think so. I think I should take battle scanner. I'm gonna get two free battle scanners per battle, meaning that one of his item slots opens up. And I'm happy. Also, he gets one mobility. He does indeed. Also some aim bonus and wheel bonus from the level up. Tactical Isidoro Vega. You know, I need a medic terribly. Oh well. I tried. <laughs> He's now a scout. <laughs> Fair enough. Seven sectoid corpses, seven floater corpses, four illyrium, four alien, four alien alloys, uh, weapon fragments times 14, 11 meld. I got eight from one, so there must have been at least three more canisters around. Panic in India has decreased by two, 100 money. Commander. But, yeah, oh yeah, well, still four square. However, it's pretty okay. If we can lower it to the three squares, that would be amazing. Okay. Request from Africa, alien materials. Request from Africa, request from Europe, laser carbine. Rebuild Sheev workshop. Council report. And uh, we just got into the new month, essentially. Uh, let's see the pending requests. Uh, it's just satellite transfers. Wait, one is actually... Free laser rifles! Yeah, go fuck yourself. Um, I'd rather keep those myself, you know what I'm saying? I'm gonna just check really quickly. Well, build facilities, I think we should really, really build this thermo generator right now. We have the money to. We should probably do it. Lots of power then we can build away whenever we have the money to. I don't think we're gonna need more than two satellite uplinks, to be completely honest. Doubt, I doubt it from seeing how many they just take down. I, it's just a waste of money and resources, I think. Uh, let me build by item, see if there is a shotgun of some sort. This is not a shotgun. This is the little SMG, the uh, hand machine gun or whatever it's called. Out of laser. This is... Uh, the one that's... no. And we don't, just don't have it unlocked, I guess. We just don't have it unlocked. Our trailer takes 100 money. It's a bunch of money. Seven days for alien materials. Uh, I think we're gonna build facilities and start building that. How much is gonna take? We cannot build anything else if we don't take energy, so... It's gonna take 21 days before these 21 days are over. We're... Wait, let's check. Oh, well. Yeah, no. Insufficient funds, insufficient funds. I would almost hesitate to buy it if the funds were requirement was the same, but no. 35 every month. Okay, let's just ta start building it. It's gonna uh, improve our power generation a lot. Meaning that we can uh, improve our laboratories and what have you. So, that is gonna be useful. But you guys tell me, the ones that have experience with Long War tell me, should I build several uplinks and satellites? Because right now my fleet consists of two ships, of two aircraft. One of which is being repaired, Banjo, F.O. Banjo Thompson, and one is O.P.O.P. Cantacuzino. Can, I have the feeling like building satellites and not being able to protect them will just increase panic worldwide without any reason at all. I just don't know, man. Well, sorry about that, uh, I had a slight interruption there, but I'm back. Um, well, I think we're fine for now, so let's scan for activity, see what happens. Uh, sadly, we cannot... 
It's low, so it's likely trying to land, abduct, or terrorize. Go defensive. If you can just land a sh single shot OP, that's gonna be good. The less we, can, we have to repair them, the better it is. Although, I don't know if there is any matter in this, on, on the subject. We're gonna be ready to abort. You tried. You tried. <laughs> well, um, that was awkward. No one got hit, no one got hit. Yeah, refueling. We cannot do much about it. See what happens. I'd rather have uh, that one available for high uh, flying UFOs in case they want to destroy my satellite. Alright! Picked up multiple requests for assistance. Abductions in progress are marked on the hollow globe. Good enough. Uh, let's see the barracks. View soldiers. Uh, Van, Brent, Dalek, Tis, uh, Cleared Out, and uh, Isidoro Vega are out. I still want to name him Yuri Vega. For those who don't know, check who Yuri Vega is. I'm sure you'll know. However, James Blitz Anselmo, the mage, the Blitz, the mage, is available. Uh, Jiggle Nanners, Francesca Pataki, fuck no. Uh, Space Beef Jerky is available. We might send Space Beef, jer beef Jerky. I don't know if I've sent him into any mission yet. Uh, SCN Limo, I might send him too. Yeah, I think I'm gonna send... Is Dargon available? Is Dargon still dead? Dargon is quite dead for three more days. Cheese Kitty Ness is out for three days. We don't have any medics. That is the problem. We have no medics at all. Until Cheese Ness returns. Uh, my girlfriend returns in seven days, so there's that. Oh my god, I can in two days. Can't wait. Uh... So, we're gonna probably send James Blitz. Uh, Spave Beast Jerky, SEN, Limo, and a couple of rookies I think would be the best. Rory Ross, I like you already. Um, let's see what the hell are our, our soldiers doing right now. Um, who's hanging in the pub? Uh, well, we have uh, Jiggle Nanners with a couple of ladies that I cannot recognize right away. Uh, J James working it on the uh, thingy. Treadmill, treadmill. Someone else is jealous about Vans lockers. Everyone is jealous about Vans lockers. Who is this? Is this a Selmo? This looks like a Selmo. Selmo is a bit more blonde, isn't he? I don't know who he might be. Uh, we have uh, our newest returnal space beef, space beef jerky talking to a wasted lady on the pub in the pub. Who else have we around here? Oh. There's a couple of people here. Uh, that seems like an interesting figure. Uh, is that? No, that's not Dargan. That's someone else talking to a blonde lady. And finally, in the infirmary, who is laughing it off are those that are dying. Uh, none that I recognize. There's a lot of people in XCOM HQ without having a specific face, so please do accept uh, position, open positions right now. Available for renaming, if you have any ideas, please do tell. Uh, who do we have available? Francesca Pataki. Please don't rename her. She's already useless as she is. Is in Goma Farizani. Farizani is a medic? Well, Farizani, you're gonna go in, I guess. Oh yeah, last time he was unavailable, I guess. Farizani. You're gonna go in. Hell yeah. Farizani is gonna go in. Alright, uh, but like... If, if you've seen some of the names you're interested in, just post in the comment section below. I'll, I'll make sure that I don't record any other episode until this one is uploaded, so you have time to decide upon. And if someone else is fighting for that name, just fight it out uh, in a uh, blood match. Just, like, take swords, go into arena and kill yourselves and something like that, I guess. Or don't! Please don't. I, I get little viewers as it is. Uh, <laughs> entertainment for everyone, but let's not kill each other for that, huh? Anyway, thanks everyone for watching, and until next time, be well. Bye.